Okay, to begin, what we're going to do is just show the user interface. Over here, we have the song layout. So what you can do is add different patterns. Um, I'm going to get into that in a different tutorial. Here we have the BPM um, with the speed and addition. So you can change the speed just if you want to slow it down. Uh, for the addition, it changes how many lines it skips after import inputting a note. So if it says zero, it won't move on to the next line after you put in a note. If it's on one, it's going to move down one. Then two, it's going to move down two. And you're going to have a space in between. And that just continues. For the pattern, this is the different patterns that you have. You can see because I changed this first pattern to just uh, four bars of music, uh, it says line 10. But if you go to the next pattern, it's back at 40 since that's the default. So I'm going to be working on pattern 0. And then you can expand and shrink it depending on if it's too fast. And I can show you that later. So we do have different settings here. These are more advanced and not necessary. Um, before I go on, I'm going to show you how to save this, just to be sure um, that you know. So you go to Disk Op, and what you want to do is go to Module, and then do XM. XM is a save file for these. Um, and what you want to do is change your name. So I can do FTP tutorial and then save it here. 